Quick shout out to my Patreons who keep this channel going. You can join my Patreon down in the description below. What's guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're reacting to the 10th episode of Cells of Work Co. Black. This one is titled Stomach Ulcer, Friendship and Loss. Oh boy, so um, yeah, stomach ulcers. Uh, I know of what they kind of are, but I don't actually know exactly how they function or what uh, negative effects they necessarily cause. Um, I've been lucky never to have been diagnosed with one. Maybe I've had one in my past that I just don't know what it was the cause of it. Who knows? Uh, but I, I don't think I've ever had a stomach ulcer. Uh, just like how I've never had athlete's foot from last time, uh, as we learned about uh, the effects of it. And it kind of made it seem like athlete's foot had a much bigger impact on the body, but it was just because uh, the general body condition is so bad now that there are so many cells that are missing. There's low white blood cell count, there's low red blood cell counts, there's low sperm count, there's like all the counts are down, basically. And as a result, even a simple athlete's foot infection just is not handleable by the body on its own because it's so diminished. So um, we need to have outside intervention again, which is an incredibly prevalent problem uh, in, uh, in this body. Um, and once we've done that, white blood cells have to go another ringworm battle. It's just never ending for them. And... Um, yeah, they're overworking themselves tirelessly. Um, our red blood cell friend uh, managed to help us out and calm us down from going too deep into overworking, saying, look, there's no point us overworking like this. The body's continuing to function even if we're slacking off, so take a breather and then get back to it. You don't have to be pushing yourself to 100%, 110% every single waking moment. So it was an important little discussion for our characters, but... Um, I don't think it's going to help. I don't know. I don't know where the loss aspect of this is going to be coming into, but I do not foresee this going well. I don't know how they're going to end this series. Uh, there wasn't a season two announcement at any point. I don't think there will be. Uh, the source material is finished, and I don't really want them to do another season based on how season two of uh, the regular sales and work went. I mean, yes, this is a different studio animating it, but still, I don't think we should perpetuate this series too much longer than it needs to it doesn't need to overextend its stay basically um so i think just getting this one season and having it have a good ending or a um an impactful ending i think is probably what this is going for more like i don't know if this body is going to be able to turn it around i think this might be a doomed body that like if i had to if i had to write a darker version of cells of work co black i would end it with the body dying I don't know how you would necessarily portray that, but I think that would be the most interesting because that will then reinforce the idea of, yes, like this is fun to look at and learn, but it's also there are some dire consequences to some of our actions and choices and keeping our body healthy that we should learn about and learn the importance of. And I think death would be a very impactful tool in that narrative. So that's kind of where I want them to go. Web will actually end up there. Who knows? But um, yeah, I don't know if this. I don't know if they're going to go that way. I like I said, I hope they do. But um, yeah, stomach ulcer. I guess it means we get another chance to go see the, the stomach cell, right? I think he was in the preview because um, we met him like first episode, and he was like one of the first ones to be like, "Wait, this isn't like the training manual like type things." So yeah. Also, we got our little um, kohai in the. Uh, uh, our training little uh, area so that was kind of interesting as well but um yeah i guess um with all that says let's start loading up the episode as per usual uh these are time-based form actions here on youtube if you want to see a full picture in picture you can go to my patreon down in the description below four pounds a month gets you access to all picture in picture actions i do on the channel which everything from this season and future seasons some back dated shows patreon request shows like simple gear which will be up on monday uh we also have movies such as uh, wolf children which will be up on tuesday so look forward to those uh, but here on YouTube, we have to do timer based. So, bottom left of the screen, you'll see a timer for the episode. I'll capture down 3 to 1 play, then I'll play side episode, I side episode, and we'll be in sync. Watch this one on Funimation since they licensed it. Uh, you can also watch this series on Crunchyroll if that is your preferred provider. Um, bear in mind, I am watching the Funimation version, which means we have the Anaplex and the Funimation logo to start. So, about 12 seconds logo to give or take. You can use Screen Flash on my face or the mic to tell when you're transitioning. That should help you sync it up. Pay attention to this part of my headset to uh, sync it up even easier. So, with all that said, let's get into this week's episode, shall we? In three, two, one, play. Amplex. Funimation. Cheers. Here we go. Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Recap from last time. Mm-hmm. Speaking of working when it counts, here's our next disaster we have to deal with. Oops, yeah it is. OP time? OP time. Okay. Alright, stomach also friendship and loss. Here we go. Hmm. <laughs> mm <laughs> hmm. We're going to the stomach. Mm-hmm. Yeah.
Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. It's pretty bad. Mm hmm. Right. That's pretty bad. Okay, we have our mission. Yeah, I would I wouldn't bet on that. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. Interesting, okay. Okay, there's more. Him? So we need an infection, a bacterium, something, I guess? It wasn't just lifestyle choices. Yeah. No. Oh boy. Hmm. Think he'll be back. I 
Black Blood Sales. To deal with him. Oh boy. Hmm. Inflammation, oh boy. Who is him? Hmm. Sure. Oh boy. This is a bad one. This is a bad one. Ooh. There it is. That's the cause. Oh. Seems somewhat familiar, I don't know why. Did we cover this in Cells of Work Season 1 or Season 2? What is it? Mm hmm. H. pylori, okay. We have covered this at some point. Mm hmm Mm-hmm. Oh boy. One we shouldn't be dealing with right now. That's their job. Mm-hmm. Relatively speaking, yeah.
Got a hit. Only marginally, but it was still a hit. Count this far, there's no point giving up now. Not yet. Is it actually going to be? I generally don't know with a show. Holy shit, they are doing it. Oh boy. He's gone. I did say this episode was called Loss. Fire is still going though. Oh, hello. Outside intervention again. No, it's biotic, okay. Okay. Oh, a box of ceiling I've heard of. I've definitely heard of a box of ceiling. Mm hmm. Mostly successful. Mm hmm. Mm 
Yep. We're fixing the problems, but we're not fixing the source of them. We're just reacting. They're gonna run into red blood cell, aren't they? Whoever decided to have a cheerful ED did not think about it. <laughs> I love this, but it's still, it's way too cheerful for how this part of the show is going. At least they weren't cruel enough to remove him from the ED. That would have been really cruel if they pulled, like, a school live and started removing him from things. That'd be too cruel. Well, they had the balls to do it. And makes me think that, yes, this show might start going the route of dead body. <laughs> yeah, half the people in that image are dead right now. <laughs> Which is interesting. Alright, preview for next time then. Mm hmm. Desperation. Gout! Okay. Well, there's the rocket launcher. Rebellion. Oh boy. Wow. Okay. They actually did it. They actually did it. They finally killed off the friend. I thought they might. I thought they were going to do it uh, in that initial time that he was in danger, but no, they decided to wait, so. Wow. Wow. That was that was actually really, really well done. Like, really well done. Hmm. Hmm. There was something I wanted to say at the end there, but I've forgotten it already as I was getting into that. All right, gout. Gout. Um, what is gout? Like, I've heard the word gout, but I have no idea what it actually means. Desperation. Rebellion makes me feel like something major is about to happen as well. But, I mean, something major has been happening for, like, the entire season, so... Um... But yeah, I've heard of amoxicillin. I think my dad even took amoxicillin after his time in hospital. I think it was amoxicillin. Which makes sense if they uh, suspected something in the stomach, so... Yeah. Yeah. That was actually very, very impactful. I love the way they did that, because in any other series, you're expecting them to catch the hands and for him to pull him back up, right? Any other show every other series you'd expect that to be the outcome not for him to fall in like that honestly really really well done i love it i love the way they actually managed to portray that yeah which is just more and more um going into my theory that maybe this is going to end with the body dying. 
just more and more I feel like that might be the direction they're going with this, and I sincerely hope it is, because it's actually very impactful like that. Because, like, we've seen red blood cells die, we've seen other red blood cells be destroyed in disaster, we've seen white blood cells float away, we've, like, we've seen all of this, but it, like, we're not connected to that cell, per se, we're connected to, oh, this is our cell, this cell's never gonna die on us. And I don't think as many people would have been uh, as attached to the, the friend so much. Um, just because of his attitude, maybe. I don't think people would have connected with him as much. They'd understand him, but they wouldn't be connected with him as much. So this is about as impactful as you can be without killing off a main title or main named character. Not that these have names so much in this series, you know, but... Um, yeah, that's about as impactful as you can be without having just a total body death. So done well but uh yeah as they pointed out nothing's going to change unless the body itself changes and well that's not likely it's gonna be one hell of a turnaround this late in but i don't think it's gonna happen we've only got what three more episodes left yeah three more episodes left of this i know i'm aware the series is already finished but we're catching up uh, because I had to take extended breaks due to everything that happened in um, in February, along with my dad going to the hospital, as well as work and everything else that went on. It was such a month. Um, yeah, very, very good episode. I love the way they played that. It was just well done. And that's probably why this season is so much better than season two of Cells at Work regular. Like, this show is impactful. It's more interesting, I think. And it has better direction, better animation. It's just overall a better product. And honestly, I wish they... I almost wish that Season 2 of Cells of Work didn't happen. Then more attention could have been given to this on its own. I know it's different studios, so it's not necessarily a problem there. But I still feel like more attention should have just been on Cells of Work Code Black. They shouldn't have been released at the same time, at the very least. We should have got either Black to hold us over until Season 2, or we should have got Season 2 in preparation for Black. One or the other, not both at the same time, because they're being... Cells of Work Season 2 will be unfavorably compared to this forever, basically. People will probably say, watch Season 1, watch Code Black, maybe go watch the movie if it's available, and then probably... People might be saying skip Season 2, which would be a bit of a shame, because it just wasn't as interesting for some reason. So, anyway... That's going to do it for today, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the ones per usual. Leave a like if you did, as well as your comments will be for the episode. Uh, don't forget to hit subscribe as well to see the next episode, because I'll be doing episode 11 straight after this. So if you're watching this one, episode 11 should already be up, uh, or will be coming up uh, within the next like half hour or so by the time you're watching this bit. Um, so yeah, look forward to that. And don't forget to hit subscribe for winter 2021 series that are wrapping up, as well as the spring 2021 season that kicks off officially on Monday with uh, Mario's the Patriot Part 2. Thank you for watching. Till next time. See you guys later.